This is why they're more successful than you. According to Noah Dennis here, I'm gonna react to this. We're gonna see why stupid people are more successful than you. Do, are you insulted? Good, let's find out why. Like, I I'm curious. Everyone I'm not and insulted. their moms are on the internet today. And it's a no brainer as to why traditional cable TV is becoming more of a relic. Stupid people do be doing, Nowadays, doing crazy creators shit, though. take the mantle in becoming modern day TV. And that looks something like people watching TikTokers, YouTubers, and even streamers such as I Shall Speed, oh, Kai and Nat, and Aiden Ross. And bro, whether you like these people or not is irrelevant because even people that you would generally consider dumb are becoming the faces of today's creator's economy and becoming successful whilst doing so and shit, i mean look at the stats the creator economy is said to be worth 250 billion dollars currently That's and insane. it's predicted to be way more by 20 you know honestly i feel like he's gonna take a, a huge dig at like uh even like youtubers and shit like that and i mean like, he already said streamers like i'm a streamer i don't take any offense to it because there really are like you know stupid streamers you know in quotes or whatever like i get it i get where he's about to like come from or whatever and obviously he's a content creator too so he's like it's obviously in the grand scheme of things it's like He's not trying to insult anybody, I don't think, but I know I know what he means. Like he's just like basically stating these people are dumb, but they're they're winning, bro. Like they're winning, bro. And like sometimes you gotta go stupid to win. Like you you feel me? And they they're doing dumb as shit. Like and they winning, bro. And you know maybe like and may, maybe some people could use just a little bit a uh, little bit of stupidity maybe just to just to uh, amp things up for their streams or something or their videos. You know what I mean? Thirty and like many creators, I don't consider myself that bright. In fact, I think I'm a genuine dumbass that just happens to put an effort to create something valuable and put it out there into the world. But here's the thing: I most of that. you are probably way smarter than most creatives, but choose not to act on the greatest opportunity given to us yet, and that's to create content online. So with me telling you this, I hope to give you clarity as to why stupid people are more successful than you. <laughs> And the reason why dumb people tend to be more successful is because they just try and they're not stuck in analysis paralysis like the smart person. Because here's the thing, smart people tend to overthink everything that they do. Examples being, what if my family and friends and people from school slash work see my videos? If you didn't know, nobody know, cares. Man. But, but, but I don't have all the equipment I need. Which is another limiting belief. I, I assume if you're watching this, you have an iPhone, iPad, computer, that has a built-in camera, mic, you need lighting, you choose room light. And that's the thing. All of these are excuses that lets you procrastinate on a decision that could potentially change oh your gosh, life I'm and something that you could generally enjoy doing but the problem is most intelligent people overanalyze too much and dumb people and you'll find out why i put dumb in quotations in a bit just do it regardless of anything and it's not to say that less intelligent people don't think at all but more so the fact that they know that if they don't act now the regret of never trying is going to tear them apart like bro let me tell you a story and this takes place way I back that, when bro. i was in seventh or eighth grade and back then it was taboo to have a youtube channel or tell people that you have a youtube channel otherwise if they found out that you did then they'll ridicule you or make fun of you and so there was this kid in my school who had a youtube channel and his name was lucas and one day his video got noticed by this really big youtuber named phase adapt that has over like millions of followers right and lucas was featured on his video because he used to troll the fuck out of phase adapt and his crew and naturally he responded to it and trolled back lucas just like how he would any other kids that he was reacting to once that got noticed and it blew up lucas gained a lot of exposure and popularity at my school like for example on one end you had kids making fun of him and then on the other hand, you had people treating him like he was royalty because a big YouTuber noticed him. That's actually a dope story, discouraged bro. him to the point to where he didn't want to oh, upload damn. any more YouTube videos. And Never in my mind. opinion, had he not listened to all the naysayers, all the haters that were criticizing him for being on YouTube, I think he would have been farther ahead in his content creator journey right now, like with a loyal big oh, follower. Oh, God, he would have been. he generally has a personality and all that shit that encompasses being a YouTuber, which is just, yeah, just being, being you. you. And they yeah, for real, bro. Like... I don't understand why people have such a hesitation to start. I got a cousin that started some content. He sold up on it and then fell off of it. Like, that, that shit wild to me, bro. Like, you do it on your own time, bro. Like, do it when you can. Like, and that's how it starts. Like, content, you gotta be consistent. I know that you do have to be consistent. But, dog, take your time, bro. Like, you can do it. Anybody can. Like, you can jump into it. Just do it on your own pace, on your own time. Don't let the stupid people win. Like, you know what I mean? Come on, bro. Get up and start your own thing. Like, even if it's just reactions, even if it's just the, this, even if it's just that, it's like you can start something and make it great. Like, I don't know. It may, may not ever be great, maybe. But you can, like, do something with it. You know what I mean? You can at least try. If you don't get up and try, what's the point? You know what I mean? 
Anyway, I'm a thing is, places like it. social media and things like YouTube aren't just a place for you to I'm watch funny videos. It. It's an accumulation of a lot of things. People come on platforms like YouTube to educate themselves. It truly is free. Something that alters your state where they learn something or feel something. You know what I mean? And here's another thing that separates dumb people from the intelligent people. And that's the fact that dumb people have like this childlike ignorance to what they believe they can do. And <laughs> just act on it because knows. that's just how much they believe in themselves. With the smart person, like how I mentioned before, they're always stuck in analysis paralysis. And in some cases, they have a, a perfectionists take on things and think that they need to have x y and z in order to do something that's straight up like dumb it's stupid that's like the equivalent of someone saying that they need to have all the information of like dieting and workout plans or whatever to start going to the gym versus the person who doesn't have any information about the gym and just go straight in the first day regardless of having any information or not and is willing to look stupid while doing so and learn along the way that's a similar way you got to view content creation you're not going to have everything you don't need to know x y and z you just need to upload the shit. and bro guess what the person <laughs> who has exactly. less info is going to learn as he goes or as she goes versus the person who never goes at all and makes excuses and negotiations with themselves. They never succeed at all. It's that simple. And bro, the same logic applies to every other aspect of your life, especially if it's something new. And not to mention, you're going to have to be willing to look stupid for a little bit until you become a master at said thing. Everybody starts off as a novice. Think about it when you go to the gym. Everybody had a starting point where they didn't know anything about dieting, nutrition, training. They just kept going 100%. until they eventually absorbed a, a little bit more knowledge and practice over and over again with consistency and bro this is what you call having a student mentality to keep on learning and doing things along the way as you go on your journey even excluding the potential amount of money aspect that could be made from doing content the very fact is when you make content of your own what happens is you tap into this innate human desire to create something and materialize it into the world where it didn't exist prior and it's amazing because bro the entire world could potentially see the work that you created you guys are watching what I'm creating right now which is valuable well, hopefully if it is hit the like button for me but <laughs> yeah, yeah. But i ain't gonna lie he, he's, he's been speaking to facts for the past like two minutes but making content simple idea you just gotta do it bro you gotta hit upload you gotta have the uh the willpower to do so bro you just gotta, you gotta break through the barrier and just go for it man you have an idea put it put it on there and go hit upload and do it bro and this is why I think regular TV is dead and the internet is taken over and it's yeah, worth it. Ain't much nobody more. rocking cable, now, bro. You can't you. say it's not fair that people are making this much online on the financial side of things and they're making more than doctors, in some cases, some lawyers, but that's just what it is. The market dictates you who be doing gets it more eyes and therefore gets more money. Even you watching this content, that's the reason why content creators are getting paid more so than doctors. You heard what I said in the stat the creator economy is worth billions of dollars. And bro, not just that, even some doctors are seeing how beneficial posting on social media is and are using this to their advantage even whilst yeah. having a job so you can still do both like bro your fear of being seen is holding you back from tapping into your true potential and human desire to create any excuse that you have is irrelevant because one you're not special everybody who hasn't started is likely thinking the same thing you are i mean shit if you check the comments you will actually see some limiting beliefs being made and two if you think you For need real, some bro. type of arbitrary prerequisite of having a personality and certain equipment those things you don't need and you have something to offer to the world and if you think that you don't have something you're lacking in some area of you find personality it, or some department then it could be developed online just keep posting which is why you should also subscribe to this channel because it's technically a self-improvement <laughs> channel and that so it's a win-win literally just stop listening to naysayers and hop on this opportunity because time's gonna go by anyway so why not just use some of this valuable time to be like the idiots who create content for you to consume and i'm not talking those about aren't even all idiots either bro. just giving examples because they're like the faces of like the big yeah. name streamers and when i say things like idiots i don't mean it in like a derogatory term I, I mean, already more knew, like bro. a metaphorical sense to describe someone who acts regardless of having all the answers. You know what I mean? But some of them are idiots, though. Don't get me wrong. Like, genuine dumbasses. <laughs> but just create something, and future you will be glad that you did. Yeah, and yeah, that brings to the end of this video. If you guys found value from this, please don't forget. That, that was actually a good video. It, it, it honestly, like, I feel the motivation, bro. You, you feel me? Like, I already do and make content, bro. But if you're not making content out there and you thought about it, you ever wanted to do it, bro, leave something in the comment section, bro. Uh, I might plug you into something, might not, it all depends on what it is, I don't know what your question will be if you have any, I don't know everything bro, I don't claim to know everything, but I can tell you some things I know, I can help you out, I'll try, you know, this guy could probably help you out even more to leave something in his comments section, you know what I mean, go subscribe, go like, he's, he's, he's providing good information bro, he's, he's good motivation too, I'm not gonna lie, I got some other videos to go make bro, streaming, I'm still doing that, I'm gonna leave the Twitch down below, Make sure to tune in that whenever I go live. Should be soon. Still working on the schedule. But I'll catch y'all later. I'll see you next time. I'm out of here.